making brownies. Excuse me. There are eight grams. Why am I showing you this? No. It's a cupboard. Oh. Full of eggplant. Yep. <laughs> I can't reach it, so I'm always like shoving them in. But and then when I let go of this, if I let go of this, I can't oh. reach it. So <laughs> take your pick, folks. Actually, I have some. I have. I have one for him. If I get a stool, maybe. Hold on. Yes. So we're gonna make uh, Jamie Oliver's brownies. <laughs> My best friend. Uh, no, because I've made these before, and I've kind of modified it a little bit. But I've made them before, and they're really good, and they're really easy to bake. Okay. I'm guessing you like me. Do you like me? Yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Amelia, and look at Amelia's apron. Can you show your apron? It says "Mummy's Little Helper," and then Eduardo says, <laughs> "Can I see?" He says, "Mummy's Little Monster." <laughs> so they're both gonna help because it's got chocolate in. Obviously, it's a brownie. <laughs> but brownie. hopefully, they don't spoil their lunch. Brownies. Brownies, yeah. Can you say Jamie Oliver? Jamie Oliver. <laughs> we made for oh. you. We made They're for you, because look. What? <laughs> Natasha forgot to put the butter in. <laughs> so, they're for you. You forgot to put the butter in? No. Brownies for you? That changed quickly. <laughs> I just went for my walk. No way, you forgot to put the butter in. Yeah. It's good though for you. Yeah. Literally, there's nothing in them, only right. like chocolate, flour. Okay. Everybody's melting down. I'm just gonna shut up. After evening, noon, night, evening, morning, delight, friends. <laughs> I don't even know what time it is. Uh, I've had a busy morning, but I'm back. Back once again with the Renegade Master. It's a nice afternoon. The kids are having a lunch in about maybe an hour or so's time, and I was like, let's take them out for a little adventure. Wanna go on a little adventure, Wardo? Okay, we are ready. Are you ready to go, mister? You ready to go? <laughs> Watch this. Every time I lose the flag. Oh, I didn't lose it that time. <laughs> well, Mr. Sun. Sun. Mr. Golden Sun. The Wardo does not like solo riding as much. I think he's trying to get his helmet off or something. <laughs> Emilia likes it solo and she likes it with Eduardo. Eduardo likes it with Emilia. Not so much on his own. Not so much at all on his own. But still, it's nice every day. Huh? Can we go home? He you needs your sister with you? Do you? Needs his big sister to make sure everything's okay. Where'd you get that one? Only a matter of time. Before we go to the the mozzarella paradise. That wasn't very obvious. Oh. <laughs> Tell me why are you so blind to see that the ones that we love? Anna's a hip hop expert. Go and break down some beats there. Spit some rhymes. I'm gonna use this rocket that you keep forgetting about. <laughs> I got you rocket and you don't eat it. I got you rocket, you don't eat it. <laughs> <laughs> got the mozzarella, we got the pomodoro and the rucola. With some olive oil and tomato. Salt, I mean. <laughs> what? Nice. This one's be prepared for a photograph. Oh, that one looks good. Look at the drizzles. You made a hamburger? Wow. That's the parent response. Did you? Wow. You're amazing. You spend too much time together. I know. You start saying each other's things. <laughs> you start finishing each other's sandwiches. Sandwiches. <laughs> okay. Go away. You what? Get this little fellow over here. Get this little 
I'm just trying. He's a struggler. He's a struggler. And then he wakes up and he's like, oh, is there food there? Let me just get this in my mouth here. Oh, I'm just half chewing my hand. Right, I'm a little bit nervous because I'm off to the dentist to get my Invisalign fitted, like my the molds done of my teeth or whatever. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of I'm freaking out right now. Also, because I was supposed to get my wisdom teeth removed and I haven't yet, and I'm scared my dentist is gonna be cross with me. <laughs> and I've got an LS sticker on my camera. <laughs> so, yep. <laughs> My life is falling apart. <laughs> Just waiting to be seen. I don't even know why I'm so nervous, but I am. And I forgot one of my bank cards. Oops, it's not going well. Hi. <laughs> oh, clunk. Hi. Okay, so, going kind of on holidays. So I decided to get some new clothes and I thought I would do an unboxing clothing summer haul video thing. Got my air, very important. I got these shoes, I also got like trainers as well for FitCon and stuff because I'm like, you do so much like standing and walking around but I saw these and they're really nice. So is this what you do? You open the box this way? Anyway, are they really nice? They're like a suede, um, put it in Ralph Lauren polos, but they're really nice. They're like a suede, I don't know what you call that kind of a shoe, but uh, it doesn't look really nice. It's so comfy and squishy. I like squishy shoes. I got lots of these. Uh, what are they called? What's the official term? Isn't that, isn't that cute? Look, it's really nice, isn't it? Um, apparently it's from the actual like polo team or something like that. I'm not really sure, but the team of this particular clothing haul, I believe, is polo. <laughs> isn't that one? Isn't that one? This one just says uh, NJ or something like that. I don't know. I'm a big fan of the old polo shirts. I'm not sure what this is. Oh, check this out. Turns into a t-shirt. It's just a t-shirt. That's all. Just a t-shirt. Just bad. Just a pair of shorts. How wick? No idea. But just a pair of shorts. Shorts. It's another polo shirt. But it's a white one. Isn't that nice? I thought that was nice. There's a thing in the side of it. Another t-shirt. I'm not even gonna open it. <laughs> another pair of shorts, same as their ones. Uh, another t shirt. <laughs> another pair of shorts, same as the other ones. I like these shorts, I just bought three of them. I just bought three of them. Um, I assume these are like t shirts as well. That's pretty much it. I'm finished. She did everything, she took the molds. Um, and she said that she wasn't cross with me but she did say that I need to have my wisdom teeth out so I'm gonna have to do that at some point which I'm really dreading where are my keys why can I, why can I never find my keys <laughs> oh my god I was so nervous I think I was more nervous that she was gonna be cross with me for not getting my wisdom teeth <laughs> looked after or taken out but that was exciting I got all my um molds done for my trays and it's cool like I just they're gonna be sent off now and now I can see like all of the teeth moving you know digitally uh, I ha can't see it yet but on my next one which is in three weeks time so I'm kind of excited I'm just I'm nervous about I wish the wisdom tooth thing was out of the way but it was supposed to be by now I'm just scared of being put to sleep that's my issue Mr. Martin's getting some full six tampons woohoo I got some new hay fever tablets because um Claritin doesn't work for me but Zyrtec does but I can't get Zyrtec here I think I got it in Italy last so I don't know I got this purity so hopefully it works and some deodorant and stuff because I need to stock up because we're going to LA 
How do you guys like my parking? <laughs> I may have some trouble getting out of there tomorrow. <laughs> Did that woman attack you? What kind of game are you playing? Oh, the ha ha game? Oh, <laughs> we're like, what? <laughs> it's mommy, her face. She's like, who is it? <laughs> it's mommy. Mommy! What are you Word oh! She just dived in. <laughs> this, is, this isn't a ball pit. This is a ball pit. <laughs> It's far from it. Now get out of here, your little toesies. Come on. I see mommy. What? I see mommy. Do you? <laughs> Boy. Oh. 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 Oh no. The rain has a comet dropping on my head. It makes me a little bit sad. Going. Come on, quickly, we gotta get this inside. It's Wardo! Wardo! Oh, jeez. Oh, Alright, come on! Heave! Ho! That is a stormy oh. situation that erupted. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Mm -hmm. Isn't it rainy? Going in my house. Are all the ladybirds going into the house? Yeah, so it will be raining. Yeah, that's why we built the house for all the ladybirds. Yeah. Yeah, for the ladybirds so they can go in. Look, at the this. I'm going to get my wand. Oh, your wand? Yeah. You going to fix the weather with your wand? Yeah. You going to make it stop raining? Yeah. Okay. Okay. On my wand. Yeah. How many things? Oh, so many things. Yeah, say Mikeo Abanio. Mikeo Abanio. Say it loud again. Mikeo Abanio. Yeah. Did I do it? Yeah. Quick, go on it. Come on, on my tail back. Well, how long is it going to take for the rain to stop? I can do it. Oh, can you? Romeo. Come on, on my bunny back. I'm sorry, what? Come on, on my body back. Your birdie? Back. <laughs> Come on. on. Ta-da! Okay, well, uh, turns out Amelia has magical powers. Because the rain has actually stopped. <laughs> huh? Kids are in bed. I just put them down. Came down to check. And yeah, turns out Amelia has mystical powers. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I am tired. I am a tired Terrence today, lads. It kind of does that to your childhood, or parenthood, more so than childhood. You know, it sneaks up in you in different, like, in like waves sometimes, and it just tires you out so much, you know? And then, um, and then it gets, and then it gets better again, and then the kids change their cycle, and it just ruins it again. <laughs> but that's part of the, uh, the challenge, you know? I enjoy, um, I enjoy the hardship, you know? And as much as, like, Emilia now is a toddler, Eduardo is on his way out of being a baby again, you know? And he'd say, like, throwing a baby into this mix now would, like, be crazy, but I'm ready for it. I'd be ready for it again. I would do it again. I think I would do it again. I know it would be crazy. It would be so tiring, you know? Uh, it would be madness and I, I, I see people leave comments and ask like about Natasha and stuff like that you know it's like we knew that we needed somebody to help us with the kids you know uh, we interviewed so many people because it was really important to us that I didn't, I didn't want to hire somebody to come here and take over you know what I mean the rearing of my child you know I'm, I'm so I'm so thankful for you guys supporting us that I'm in a position where I get to, you know, work full time and support my family, but then at the same time, I get to be part of my family all the time, and I get to, I get to raise my kids, which is really cool. But 
we both have to work as well. Like we put to myself and I both work, you know. So um, we eventually we met with Natasha and we were like, this is this is a perfect balance because, you know, I, I still get to like go and raise my kids just like I'm raising them. But sometimes when I've got to like go on meetings or I got to go to work and myself and I have to go out that night or we got to do something, it's like we just always have this little extra pair of hands that we can just use. And, um, and that's that's the story of Natasha. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go because I see these little paws and I need to go find them. <laughs> Thanks for watching today's video. We shall and uh, we shall roll an old end slate. Look at Newbie, it's always trolling me. Always trolling me. <laughs> I think I've built up this. Uh, I think I've built this up more than what it actually is. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. I'll see you tomorrow. I hope today's video was at a good standard. <laughs> Goodbye. Hi you guys, it's uh, Jonathan here and uh, it's another Renslade. Do, 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 do. <laughs> we are going to California very shortly. I'm very excited. Never been in California. Feel free to leave me some comments and suggestions of things we should do while in California. Well, how big is California? Is it bigger than two miles? <laughs> <laughs> Los Angeles. Anyone in West Hollywood, Los Angeles, is where we're actually going to be staying while we're there. Obviously, we're going to stay in VidCon when we're at VidCon, but VidCon's only like three or four days. So prior to that, we're going to be staying out in West Hollywood. So if you guys have any ideas or things to do in West Hollywood, leave me some comments and suggestions and we shall do them. And I'm, I am excited. Goodbye.